News 8 at Noon continues. Welcome back everyone. Joining us this afternoon, we have Allison Osborne here and Jason Shanley, and we are talking about the Young Entrepreneurs Academy. Thank yes. you both so much for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you so much for having sure. us. Allison, I want to start with you. For those who haven't heard of this program, tell us a little bit about it. I would love to. Mm -hmm. uh, the Young Entrepreneurs Academy is a local nonprofit organization that is actually now on a national level. Mm -hmm. and we started right here in Rochester eight years ago, and we take middle and high school students through the process of starting and running their own real legally registered business or nonprofit organization. Wonderful. So everything from brainstorming their big business idea to writing a real business plan, pitching that plan to investors for actual funding, and graduating as the CEO of their own real company that has a DBA, business banking account, and is ready to start generating profit or providing a social service. Fantastic opportunity. Now, Jason, you went through the program. Yep. Uh, tell me a little bit about the business you created. Uh, my business was called Your Locker. Um, mm -hmm. I created a business that uh, designs and sells removable skins for, uh, it started off as lockers um, mm -hmm. for the outside of locker doors and you can actually cut it for the inside too. Uh, but then I decided why not go to other devices and surfaces. So now I have laptop and iPad skins out on the market. Okay. Uh, I just created a template for iPod skins that uh, at the Young Entrepreneurs Academy is actually giving to their semi-finalists. Um, and uh, with more devices to come, um, mini fridges are underway too. So uh, it's they come in a variety of designs and it really um, it allows students or uh, college students or students in school to uh, mm -hmm. express themselves, uh, get creative. You know, um, in school uh, lockers are all, I mean, I mean, the same color at like Gananda, we all had blue lockers, and mm -hmm. I, I obviously like to stand out for my friends, so <laughs> uh, I wanted, to, I said, hey, why not have a tie-dye uh, locker? Why not have a camouflage locker? So that's where the idea kind of began. Great. Uh, you've got an event coming up we later do. this week we where do. students are taking their businesses and actually competing for scholarships? Yep, big college scholarships. So uh, we actually are running the program. As I mentioned, we started eight years ago mm -hmm. at Rochester. Uh, but we are running the program now in 13 states and have 30 different locations. So wow. each one of those Young Entrepreneurs Academy locations has their own what's called the Investor Panel event where they pitch their businesses for mm -hmm. actual funding. And not only are they competing for startup capital, but they're competing for a spot in what's called the Saunders Scholars Bright Idea semi-final competition. So one business group from each location advances to this competition okay. uh, where they are competing not for startup capital but for college scholarships. So these are the businesses that best embody the qualities and characteristics of Mr. Phil Saunders who has endowed the competition. So qualities like innovation, chance for success, uh, ability to make a difference in the community. Mm -hmm. Then all of these businesses are coming to Rochester. So businesses from Maine down to Florida over to Texas and throughout upstate New York are coming to pitch their plans and compete for college scholarships as well as an opportunity to travel to the Small Business Summit uh, thanks to the U.S. Chamber of Commerce and pitch wow. their business on a national level. Fantastic. So it's very exciting. And we should mention that Jason you won this last year and now you're at RIT using that scholarship yes, money. Yes I am. Huh? I love it there. Fantastic. Well congratulations Thank you. to you. Thank, you. Thank you both so much for joining us today. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Sure.